welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. And if you're new here, hello. My name is Ashley. I run things here at Oak Crow Gal. And today we're doing an unboxing. I do not do unboxings um, here because I don't ever get boxes of anything. Um, I don't get like keto crate or keto box or snack box or any of that stuff. Um, so I'm really excited. I'm equally as excited because I have had this for like five days and have not looked in it. Um, I shoved it in my pantry and I was like, no, 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 no. You can't look in it until you film the video because I wanted us to like experience this together, open this up together, and I am pumped. So I saw Aaron over at Aaron Does the Keto do a carnivore club um, unboxing and I was intrigued. So I reached out to them and they um, were willing to send me a box, which made me really excited because um, I, well, number one, I just think it's cool. Like, I think it's a, a neat idea. Number two, I'm bored. I'm very, <laughs> very, in the land of keto, I am very bored at the moment. And I just think this is kind of a cool way, honestly, also alongside the other keto boxes that you can get. I think all of those subscription boxes currently at the moment um, kind of fit the bill of, you know, trying things you wouldn't normally try trying things you wouldn't normally buy and so that's kind of why i'm excited because i'm hoping there are some things in here that i've never tried or that i kind of have to be like hmm how would i use that um because i'm 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 really bored <laughs> I, I really i'm just bored with the same old same old so this is the classic box this is gonna run you 44.99 if you buy it just by itself for one time um or if you subscribe it's 39.99 a month i really like that they have a just buy it once option and then a subscription option um then you're not you know i don't want to say suckered in but <laughs> then you're not suckered in to have to do it every month if you don't want to um if you're just kind of like i have some extra money lying around i want to try it it's kind of nice that you can just get one um so this is going to have four to six premium cured meats in here and then they have a smaller snack size box which is if you do a one-time purchase is $29.99 and if you subscribe it's $24.99 a month and that's just basically um the same like the same idea but a smaller box and it's made for snacking it's like made for on the go so i they don't list specifically what could be in it but based off of the pictures there's beef jerky there's meat sticks stuff like that so like i said this is the larger box and i'm really excited guys it has taken everything in me to not open this because it's not even really like sealed. I mean, the stuff inside is sealed, so like this is not a big deal, but like it just <laughs> just been wanting to peek. So, this is the box that that it comes in. It did come a little like beat up, a little rough around the edges, but I don't think I mean, I'm not going to take that out on them. Um what this was packaged in was not like the most durable thing, so I think it was just a, you know, packaging and mail delivery error if you will so let's open it together oh we got a card oh i see beautiful things inside let's look at this card so okay so everything is by this brand that's interesting so it says carnivore club usa and then it has this brand at the bottom ia ale alpia i don't, don't don't quote me on that oh cool and so then you have a monthly meat menu and it tells you everything that's in the box um, and then they also shout out this um, specific brand, Alapia, Iapia. Again, the pronunciation. Um, <laughs> they leave their um, website here. It says that it's made on the central coast of California. So that's kind of cool. So it's like a special artisan that kind of curated this whole box. So I don't want to read this because I don't want to know what's in here. Let's like jump in and look look at these things together. Ooh, this looks interesting. What the heck is this? Oh, pork jowl. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. This cure, this cures the boredom. Um, okay, so this is Guayan Xiao, Xiao. Okay, <laughs> the pronunciation in this video. Guanciale, Guayan Xiao, I don't know. It is pork, cured natural pork jowl. Um, pork, sea salt, sugar, black pepper, natural spices, Swiss chard extract, um, azorbic acid, lactic acid. Okay, so this is cured natural pork jowl. Um, minimally processed, no artificial ingredients, pork, sea salt, sugar, black pepper, natural spices, Swiss chard extract. This is intriguing to me. Now, one thing that has me concerned is that it does say keep refrigerated or frozen. Um, it says it on the back and it also says it on the front. This obviously has not been refrigerated um, because it was mailed in a box and then sat in my pantry for about a week. 
so um i'm gonna have to kind of do some research and i wonder if because it's cured you don't have to refrigerate it i'll do some research throw it up on the screen to see if i can even use this i'm hoping that i can because this is exactly what i'm talking about when it comes to just like trying something new and cure curing that boredom now i don't know specifically what you can do with pork jowl other than fry it up like bacon i have heard about that um, so this is intriguing and again, I'll kind of do my research and clue you guys in as to like if I can if I can use it I hope I can all right next up we have Salamini Barolo um, Yeah, it's basically just pork salt Barolo wine This does have dextrose in it garlic dry milk natural spices. So they essentially just look kind of look like little um, Like little salami bites kind of interesting next up we have just a cacciatorino handcrafted italian salami um pork sea salt chianti wine wow zero carbs 120 calories 10 fat 9 protein excited to try that i i think too the other reason that i'm i'm happy i got this box is because i've been bored i have already been kind of brainstorming as to what i want to kind of start doing um to change things up when it comes to keto and charcuterie is such a great way to like try new meats try new cheeses and this is gonna really like help me do that all right, next up we have two this, these this looks so fancy we have two separate um sliced Italian salami. So this is the Barolo one, and then we have the Sopressa. Um, it looks like they're pretty much, looking at ingredients, they're pretty much the same. This one has cayenne and uses Zinfandel wine, and then this one doesn't have any cayenne, and it uses that Barolo wine again that we saw um, in these. So what I'm going to do is actually, I'm not even going to throw up the info on the screen for the... Um, the pork gel. I'm just gonna look it up right now because I want to bust open some of this stuff stuff to try um, And I can I can google that while I do it So let me get a little plate prepped and I'll be back. All right y'all. So I'm back. I looked up the pork gel. We're, we're good We're good. Um, as long as it's cured it can last completely fine like not refrigerated So that has me super pumped. Let's talk about what I'm gonna try. So I have my little my little plate right here um, I pulled out one of these salaminis to try and then two slices of the Barolo and this um, Sopressa. Obviously this needs to be cooked, so I can't try that right now. Um, and then I didn't wanna bust, bust this open yet. So let's go ahead and try this little guy first. So again, this is the um, Salamini. Let's see, pork sea salt Barolo wine. So let's try this guy first. It's like a little, a little salami nugget, if you will. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, this is delicious. I was worried it was gonna be like creamy in the middle. <laughs> that sounds gross, but like just based on what it looked like, um, I thought if it's creamy in the middle, that's gonna be like a really gross texture, but it's really good. It's, I, I wouldn't say it's tough, but it is chewy. I can get down with that. That is really good. All right, that was delicious. Next up, let's go ahead and try the Sopressa. So this is what the Sopressa looks like. Looks absolutely delicious. This is the salami that has the cayenne in it. So let's see if it if it has a has a kick. It's really good. I don't taste any heat. But it's really, really good. Mmm. That's delicious. It kind of tastes like a pepperoni. Um, that is really good. That was really, really good. Now, Sopressa I have seen before, so I'm sure I've eaten it. So it, it didn't taste like, whoa, this salami is like so different. It was awesome, but it didn't taste super different to me. So I'm curious to try this one, the Barolo, um, because I've never even seen that before. And because they use this special like Barolo wine. Um, this is what this one looks like. I'm not sure if the camera's gonna pick it up, but this one is definitely um, darker than the um, Sopressa. Like it's not, it's not as like red. Let's go ahead and try it. I see the pepper flakes in there. Mm. 
This one tastes a little saltier. The Barilla tastes saltier and a little bit more, um, there is more, more sodium in this one and a little more like vinegary. Really good. I mean, how can you go wrong with salami? Well, that was fun. Um, all in all, I think that this is an awesome resource out there for people like us that are on keto or even if you're not on keto and you kind of want some charcuterie stuff in your life um, or you just kind of want to be surprised with you know specialty meats once a month I think it's a really cool option and again I like that you don't have to subscribe so that you get it every month you can just do a one-time thing and I actually think I mean they sent this to me free of cost they just said share with your people um, but I might buy the snack box just to kind of see what kind of stuff comes in there uh, this I mean I'm, I'm stoked to like munch and eat and snack on everything this has me the most excited just because um it's so different like i would never go to a store and buy this um i would only try it if it came in a box like this so that's kind of what i mean when i say if you're looking for something different and you're looking to just maybe incorporate different snack stuff or different types of meats in your life um i think this is really really cool like really a neat thing so so if y'all want to try this i will leave their website down below i'll leave a link to their snack box and to this classic box um if you if you are intrigued and you want to you want to check it out i hope you guys enjoyed this video definitely different than what i normally do but um, i'm kind of trying to incorporate different content as of late uh with the quarantine and stuff i personally find myself clicking on more grocery hauls more unboxings things that are a little more mindless so i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you in my next one bye friends